This is the Election Bureau. Welcome to the City Newsroom. My name is Vivian Kai Loko. And my name is Umaru Sanda Amadou. Coming up. In the Akwetia constituency, the decision to replace the incumbent MP Amase seems to be hunting the NPP as residents vow to vote scat and blouse for the 2020 polls. <laughs> In Kranka community in the Nkranza North constituency threatens to vote skirt and blouse against incumbent MP after allegedly chasing him out of the constituency of a poor performance. Bana ya 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 chile say, ya pesa obe ya wongu ni say, Kranka for ya ndoni bim, ntini ya saba na ya de tuwa manu, ti ya yama na yungu say ya yi nedi, ya wankaya hun. Also coming up, Renal Dance Hall at T Stoneboy preaches peace ahead of election 2020 as he pulls massive crowd in the Shama Peace War. I have realized that no particular A-list artist has taken the keen interest to want to invest and even push for peace because that is what we need. Without peace, both political parties, the humongous two cannot function. And later, residents of Shreso de Duakwa living in fear of losing their homes in an impending demolition exercise by the Free Zones Authority call for government intervention. Yes, we believe in the development of the Free Zones Authority. We believe in what the government of the, of the country is doing on these lands for the state. Nonetheless, we are just pleading on, their, on our behalf that they consider us and take us from the allocation that has been done. We'll bring you details of our stories and start with the eastern region because the Akwetia constituency in the eastern region is one of the key constituencies the National Democratic Congress is hoping to reclaim from the new patriotic party on December 7th. As the polls draw near, constituents have tabled unemployment and the impact of the fight against illegal mining on their livelihoods as the major decision factors. Now, this report, or host of the Point of View, explores the dynamics in that constituency. So we are in Akwetia, and we are trying to sense what is happening in the constituency. It's very interesting what we've heard so far. There appears to be lack of clarity on the parliamentary side. The presidential side isn't, isn't as unclear. We have been uh, speaking to some of the market women, and it looks like there's a big development. We're told that the, there was a repair work going on in the market, which they believe with Amase not being on the ticket, that may not continue. These are market women, and they're basically saying that their market stalls are not in a good shape. And they were hoping that she would have been maintained by the MPP to continue with her work. We will turn our attention to a few more of the market women and find out what really is happening with the constituency. So I'm going to turn my attention to some of the market women and I'll ask them what their view is. I have wrote 30 years. Oh, I have wrote 30 years. Yani yesika nopi. Yeni torret. 
yeni fa kwa ya jonso ye ba ye ti awemu a na ho abaji ye ticket na ho kọ ye ho she into no kwasem ni e din ma yan kasa e din pa ma yen abane de yami be mu ameto yami ambe mu so amento esro 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 president yesro e na parliament for ni ye e idioto so mienu ni mo au ye janu ye fu se oba 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 ko be ba be ya mai na ye ma me ne na na ye oba pa ma se ah mete ne tu an ma so le ona na o ye e na ye ye a chimfo ne a bibi fo na kan te ye pa de pa e na ye tu na fi so e na se se asin se ti ye bo mpa ye de oba ba oba ba be ye ni yi ama ye no e no na ye ye pe media ah so am to wo ye bo mpa ye de oba ba be di so no ah wo ba na wa nya ni ye be tu ye ya ni ye to ma ye ya ni ye be tu ne mo media de akufu adu aye ma me ni free education no e no kura ne kume no me ton pints brazier underwear me ton bibia bi e ja ne de anya kra enko yie kra eh christmas e ba so she se na ejomu aye ejomu aye deja enye eh eh nti omo nyo mu ne ma yie enye saade a eh ye beto atia no ye beto atia ban no because me ye hu she ye de ye nya she wa be m ye de ne se ye beto ade na obi abeto na ye su ye nya bibi kakra bet project bi e ni ha Insio ta ahanu muse chaka wunya baby kura na mojina yenya ne ye bo pa ye jiji sika de akọ ta anwia de abefele ensu me nim se eye council fo ejuma enye inti na omu bo mode a no omu sie sie jobu ha maye omu de obi aka de ye ne de obi aka o o wi ni o be ye o wi ni o be ye ensu ye hu se inti inti momo no my imagine jambe bo chama o me de my decided da da ai me we no me hu ni samboa me inti mesisem na nes bad ba na no so amboa me a eno so mesasisem inti na mesisem ko president ni parliament na wusisem o mesisem mesisem I feel we die. Me decide to say Okoya Neko. No size. Mahama all the way. Me two man no me two. How long? Oh, I had a warm year. Eighty many were ha. Oh, last year the air cover call. Oh, Saturday day. What we say? Yes, say half education is a poison. It is an anadoba. Now you try your husu kuso dia. And then I fall more for nana. Fall more for nana. Hey, no crepe fe. Hey, nana de. Hey, it's nana dia. Half education. Oh, tap tap tap. Oh, and yeah, yeah, to a man this minute. And this minute. Fifty fifty. Nana dear, yeah, to a mammy, baby, education. So, no, I'm a messiah to a man. But parliament in India, oh, yeah, to a man, and yeah, be a young year, a pen
emano ejun so ni ade but enu no e bo kwa o de beto so no untimi enye yi so ahun enye man ko so e wo ye kuro yi e mu oden won galam se tan pa a mo hwa de ye kuro ya ye ya enye na se galam se o mo se essay asase essay ye ye wa na ya na ye small money company and then me gcd so gcd company when a new crew, or be with us and our old down where you are, or send a papa bobra. Now, papa bobra, and they can. Ah, or be a woof is who fear a petty consuancy. Also, papa bobra. You was as old down where you are, so papa bobra. What did be that? As I will say, be a midan waha, and I'm a honey, or so your consuancy would that. Yeah, we are, and it's nowhere, Baba Bejina. So, I must say, you must also open this, and I must say, no. Yes, or you do my MP. I must say, yeah, Juma. Or yeah, Juma or Bayano, or yeah, and so, and any dear. Catra at the boy. Oh, Bianca, I must say, yes, I know. I must say, yeah, and so, and any dear. Or perform more fine. You're going to summon a dear. But a twenty, a free two thousand and two thousand and eight. Eba twenty sixteen, a dear. Na a ye. If it's a omoko, na se omoko pena omunya, and I answer ye giano, omotoma ye. Na I say no, eh, omoko juma, ne a chim omatum, am robbers, and an amoho, ne a chi omwa, omoka pedidi, abedi, ne a kumkume binum, sa ukon zona noa, bebre a kumamagum, or be kumube kwejuma, or mefi, nansu se say, and we are say, ma a yan for. And you go there, Juma. I say, ministers, ni DCs, ni MPs, and the area, a Juma. Yaji, a Juma, no FDA, a young phone, sim, at the Ama, a Sikafo. And see a bomb pire say, Obia or Dot or Mino, Ah, or Mino, Edo Edana Comaso, your minor Dana Comaso, and young coupon, and your day, and you know, and my young. Every say, a memon, um, a big cock, not a beaba. Oman Penny could fall by an Yehuna mem or man penny JJ Rorris, Yehuna memo, or man penny could fall, Yehuna memo, or man penny at a must, Yehuna memo, and Sana, Jamus, Yehuna memo, and Sana, Obia, family and friends, family and friends, or no, no, Sikeni, Ebenesica, O Yeni, Ebeke, Yemu, Amen so. Abba. So, uh, three SHS. Three SHS. Three SHS. Me pacho me me ton ejiani o secondary school. Aquatech. Uh, eh ho ena me ton ejiani. Bra. Eh mo bo. Enti sa uba ko school. Uba ko secondary school. Na se okase. Okase e free education. Enti o man ejiani a. Wa hano. Me. Ejiani me ton o secondary school. Me nyeska o. If you say, Me whom Kalano Mobo, Me whom and Kalano Mobo, or be on my free education, Tinema Mia Mani Pro, Nipa Mani Scow, Nima Mia Mani Sika, Omu de Nina, I to say a bind by ye. Now so a com, a man Kalano Bokrono, Pawedi, one master of Babuaganao, or by Sir Obeyeni, or by a Sir of a Penedi, or Nina Busian for Eba by Jake Ganesica, Edia. Et si a bon paye se, nyan koupon mwa, na onye o dikan fwo, a o jen gana fwo hon, en maye, onu ni jen, o koyo, wa yebi. Onyam ka se ope, ope se obedi empi no, no o koyo foundation. Onyam ka se obedi empi no, o wong kwa lebi ya, te se every year, o yi, ye nim omwa wa shom university, Yenim Oma washroom nursing training. Yenim Oma washroom secondary schools. Yenim Oma or the Oma community. Yenim Oma or the Odi Oma police. And the Okoyo Nas say, What did you do with the Diano? And yes, sir. Now who of Fabian Tina Dono? Nan Unumapa. 
and a better near Oya Day, near Betuama. So we are at a team Kusi, we are still in the Denchambo district. We are told that there's oil palm research institute not too far from here. We've just met some of the community people to find out how things are going. Daddy Maha, yeah, yeah, bow. But you're afraid, my friend, Bernard, if he's city TV in crying, but you're frozen. A friend could do bedu. It's a good bedu, Mohunti send a handsome Mohunti send. Oh, Boko, Bonnie Bienu. Mumpuntum, Sam send a sick or oh, okay, is that a barn or bar or yet? A quiet am I? Or yet a quiet am I? And you will be that. I will cast a fear, a buy a full flow by or no, I may not send Puntu in the Puntu in the near Ajahon, the near Jahon Pa. Near Libra, a cup. Oh, Cusimesi, Jumatisan, a Jumano, and Koi, says, says, can your mind into being caught us a man self a bear, I tell you, man, I say, Oh, quite you, man, I dare to your uncle. I tell you, sir, I buy and say, I'm going to say, then me, a juma, a bet for you to know. No, be a near juma, and I was soon a cacran, no, be a no, and you know, they are there. I told you, and MPP in the city parties now can I dare not, near juma, yes, I did. And the MPP. I'm a damn one people. President, the parliament, you know, that be parliamentary, me, damn, who could you? Return we'll to Bernard Avle in a bit, but let's go to another region. Now, residents of Kranka, a community in the Kranka North constituency of the Bono East region have resolved to vote against the incumbent MB, Major Retired Derek Odro, but to vote for the party's presidential candidate, Nana Kufuado. Now, the residents who allegedly hooted and drove away the MP during a recent visit claim he has not spearheaded any development in the area. Our Bono East Regional Correspondent Michael Chachuaholo has more. At the center of the Kranka community is a banner urging voters here to vote against the incumbent MP, but vote for the NPP's presidential candidate and what has become known in Ghana as skirt and blouse voting. Residents have resolved to vote out major retired Derek Odro solely on the basis of non-performance. The residents on 13th of November this year exhibited their disappointments in the NP, who is also the deputy defense minister, by allegedly hooting at him and chasing him out when he visited the community to interact with them and traditional leaders. But the NP has denied being chased out of the community. Banda ya 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 chile se, ya pesa obe ya wongu ni se, kranka foye ndo ni bim, mtini ya sabana ya de tuwa mano. Tia ya mana yungu se ya yi nedi, ya wankaya hun. Ya hundi ya niya hun, niya mpuntu ni waina ha, hii niya, ba watu nono ma, wa ya mpuntu ni wa, wa ya se, nsa adia nje sa ha. Uwa nye kwa, uwa nye ya shi wopromu ha, diye timi ntila nshe, na nandu diye, ya itana chiti se, atacha. Obako, ya wa choma wano diye, na papa ya diye. Obesi, <laughs> Kranka has a voter population of 2,548, which is about 10% of the total voter population in the constituency. According to the residents, their grievances have also been expressed by the entire constituency.
Major retired Derek Odro became the MP after a by-election in March 2007, when the then MP Eric Amwateng of the NPP was arrested in the U.S. and jailed for drug trafficking. The Nkranza North New Patriotic Party refused to comment on the concerns raised by the Kranka community when contacted. It's still the City Newsroom when we come back. We'll take you back to the Equatorial constituency and gauge the mood there ahead of the elections. Stay with us, we'll be back soon. Rigworld Solutions, forging the frameworks of Ghanaian industry. Engineering solutions from the heart of Takrade Kejebil. At Rigworld Solutions, we manufacture industrial bolts and nuts, fasteners, hoses and fittings for the extractive and petrochemical industries. World-class products with local expertise. Locate our factory in Kejebil, of the Takradi Takwa Road. Call 0302-949917 or 0540-107504. Email enquiries at rigworldsolutions.com. Rigworld Solutions, crafted in Ghana, engineered for the world. The NDC's People's Manifesto. It be top one. See, what you know, bro? You know, say me as a day. Me now they do my hustles one and two. They get money. They take settle my school fees. But right now, Joe Mahama say Chemupe, which means the NDC Bahama led government will pay fifty percent of school fees for all tertiary students in the universities, polytechnics, college of education, nursing training schools, and so on. Charlie, <laughs> John Mahama be visionary. Jempe go is pressure for parents and students in the matter of pound. The moment they flip me be the increase of the student loan to meet the needs of the students. And it will be paid on time. Ah. Uh, you know, see, after John Mahama increased the student loan mm -hmm. 2600 in 2016. Mm -hmm. Oh, no at car press since 2017. Ah. Oh, yeah. I'll be here, see. John Mahama say he go cancel the guarantor requirement. So say student who access the loan without the need for a guarantor. Oh, as for that move there, my mama ah. cost one. <laughs> what they finish maybe say, your mama say you go bring back the student loan plus scheme. Ah. Yeah. This scheme will allow students to get admission to tertiary schools. See, apply for loan even before them go to school. Charlie, your mama do all. This thing, I go be free from hustling to pay my school fees. I go have time to study Buddha and top my class. <laughs> Any challenger? No <laughs> challenger. My guy. Champagne. Vote John Mahama and NDC for jobs and prosperity for all. Looking for something new this November? Looking for star-studded suspense? It's what rich, entitled people do when threatened. They conceal the ugly truths to protect themselves. Maybe you're in search of true love. Roses are red. Violets are blue. I got a crush on you, baby. Which be my food? What about a bit of family drama? Need something to keep the kids entertained? We're ready to help with the case, Mira. We'll look for clues. Perhaps criminally good comedy is your thing. Whatever you're in the mood for, look no further than DSTV.
Pharaoh, what does he want to take to bring back four solid years of Musa? Maybe to create food and share or hand over the country's entire book to his brother. See, incompetence again. No way. We have come a long way to take any risk. Charlie, see, we can't afford to lose one D, one air, one constraint, one ambulance, one district, one warehouse, one village, one, one dam, one. Ah, one boy, one girl. Cool down. Now cool. For food and jobs. See, even a greenhouse farm here, and you pretend. I live. Ghana crab, Ghana crab. People, you forget the almighty free and free. You plenty, you plenty. You plenty. Welcome back to the City News Show. We return to the Aquitia constituency as Bernard Avalet speaks with residents there over the upcoming election. Okay, so we are at uh, Wenchi, which is not too far from uh, Aquitia. Mama, uh, Maha. Yeah, yeah. What's your first I'm from your ma. What's your name? I'm from your house. 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 I'm from your it's <laughs> It's a media meha one on the here baby I be a nine, never be a co bola, a go me how pan on election never over to abba. Ya mean to me at two abba, some in an munti and some to abba. Present who toma hina. Eh, me to ama ku for ado. Na me we are massa to ama next kumi. I don't I don't want to send you sick. Ah do Eh yeah dear, be fun sa cause you be be afa. Na e pro ha ejuma be san amoye. Oh oh ejuma ne ye wa dear, na e gramsi. Ye na nam no am ejuma mo ye pan gramsi. E se ku da ku fa do ba na gramsi ne nyadjuma biem. E ti e se ne de akoye moto ke ya na, ene eh okeda ya na ye na kan kra. Gramsi ne ye den na ejuma ne se. Gramsi ejuma no. Ah ku fa do ba ye no. Ana o se ye sen sa se no. Then so can a credit and sassy and the FTN and my breast no more dia, best and can say that. It is so say a best and a sin soon so are on your present with me and can say, Wouldn't I? It's the work on the best one. Lemon go, yes, I know the comma, a human be the show my so we say, be the announcement being said, but a Yanisa. It's you know, on all the homes, it means chance a change now, one day on the sun. It is a wow about over twenty cents. Okay, so far, I want to be the frank, I don't know. I could for the I because I'm to be I'm I'm going to be a baby. I'm going to be a baby. I'm going to be I had a problem with the baby. Yes. A B and say crook is here. What I Public toilet cry in the back of 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 the I am who ye in the crana, as I am new. Say, yes, and be fear and then the bequa. Now, quiet, I said. Ayo, how pa empties now, my baby. I don't know, man, your money on my car was him. Your new on my car, come over, San Ubiak. Oh, you buy a bay, your queen, your queen, I am my. It's a more young guys now, more town, no, a jumabin, I'm with a jumadier, cruma padia, a jumabian cruma. 
Ajuma bi ani kromu ase. Youth na aban aban wo beto anamu nto. Ye de ye decide say ye nto aban. The same story na oh you want to my ye nimu ani free ase ye bodam free fie sa yi na na ye ka. Ba ye nya ba no ano no ye gai ye gai ye sa. Na na ni kuminiye na na ni kuminiye na na ni kuminiye na na ni abana ye. Front of the Akwetia MPP office with Enes Kumi, who is the MPP candidate. His supporters are here as well. Hey, more ho. Enes Kumi, your baby, yo. Hina ne wini. Enes Kumi. Inti anyu mena mutu mano. Those are the supporters of NS Kumi. I don't know if you're Teteresta. Is that your name or your nickname? <laughs> I mean, Tetelesta is a song, and uh, if you look at my team or my motto for this election, um, I, I, I say new covenant, new hope. Basically, we've not had a quintessential leader who's been able to deliver the promises of the people. And I have pledged to the people that I want us to covenant freshly on a new note, and they, I'll present to them the new hope that they are desiring for. So that's how come you see on my posters, new covenant, new hope. And that's how come they are also singing Tete Lester. We, we came here earlier and it looked like there was a division in MPP. Some supported Amase, some are saying Eneskumi. What's going on? I mean, it's quite unfortunate that uh, those issues came about. We went for elections. And as you know, in accordance with participatory democracy, whatever be the case, we'll go for elections. And one person will emerge as a winner. I won, and as you know, there are always sound losers and people who always feel aggrieved. We did the best that we could as part of the reconciliation processes for other persons to come on board. Um, as I speak with you, the leaders of the party came in, and majority of the people are on board, and we are all working together as a team to make sure that the victory that we so much desire is delivered. Some people say you are being supported by the regional chairman and the organizer because you are from the same part of the region, which is why this whole controversy started. What's the real situation there? I mean, that doesn't make any difference. It's still the same constituency, even if what they are saying is the truth. Every politician must have a base and you must have a support, you understand? And even in line with our party's um, historic policies, uh, we are a party that believe in conservatism. And whatever be the case, you must have some godfathers and people you do expire to learn from. And so even if um, I have the support of the regional chairman, I don't think it's in bad taste. But I can stand here and confidently tell you that um, our regional chairman never supported me in any way, whether in kind or in cash, though he supported that he wanted me to win. Not in any way did he support with his substance or any form for me to win this election. Be it as it may, on the election day, he wasn't within the constituency. As you know, he had other duties to discharge, and he was somewhere within the region. So I don't think it had any impact on the elections. But um, people will always read meanings into things. And for instance, if my opponent wanted his support, then they could have garnered for it. But they didn't garner for it. They used him against me. They mentioned they used him as a base for people not to vote for me. So if you use someone as a base for people not to vote for me, and in the end I turn up winning the election, why should that be a problem to you? It's a few days to the national election. What is your message to the Akwetia people in terms of the national election, presidential and also parliamentary? What are you telling the people of Denchembo and areas around? What I keep telling our people is still the same message. Elections always have impact on the people. The impact can be good and it could be bad as well. So if you vote well or if you cast a good vote, you will certainly have a good result. And if you cast a bad one, you certainly have a bad impact. 
if you look at what um, President Ekufuado has done in terms of the free SHS and how it has benefited the popular people or the ordinary persons, I mean, it need not to be said again. We all know the impact. So if we vote well and we vote for President Ekufuado, we will certainly have a good impact. The NDC say it's a four years of failed promises. John Mama says it's a Sakawa government. NDC has won this seat before. So what is your message to those who think that this four years, you promised so much, you didn't do so much, and you've disappointed them? I think all these things they are saying are not premised on anything because I have heard President Mahama speak a lot of times and I've asked myself what is it premised on because when we were criticizing the NDC government whilst we were in opposition we spoke to data I'm sure you are very much aware I've listened to you a lot of times I think for several years you are one journalist I listen to you a lot of times and the analysis you do on the show and you can agree with me that when we were speaking to it if you look look at the lectures and the series of lectures that were conducted by His Excellency Dr. Mahmoud Bamiya. He spoke to the science, he spoke to the data. So if they are saying that we have not delivered, they must show it. Our story. Akwetia, NDC, constituency head office, and those who are the executives. I have here with me Henry Boati Adam. He has two nicknames. They call him Okoyo. And they also call him homeboy. Zero. Zero. <laughs> yeah, you, you have said it all. Uh, 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 zero in politics. You know, in the world, <clears throat> we do have a uh, best player in the world called Messi. And now we have three competitors in the, in the game. We have C. Ronaldo and we have Lukaku. So when Messi was going out, he had nobody to hand over the captain bag except C. Ronaldo. That's why they are giving the zero to me. In respect of we have incumbent MP, who is also called Mercy, Edu Jemfi. Now that she's going out, she has nobody to hand over the captain bag except C. Ronaldo. That's why they have named me C. Ronaldo. What about Okoyo? Where is the name Okoyo from? Okoyo is, uh, uh, let me just uh, respond this way. Um, Okoyo, in a short way, is uh, somebody who, who, who promised and then he does. That's why my the name Okoyo. Okay, no, Aha, uh -huh. yes. Okay, it's about 10 days to the election. How is it going? What is the, what is the ground? How is the ground? Uh, the ground is, uh, is doing well for us. I would say uh, the enthusiasm when you step out there, the fans there that you receive from the supporters and the comments that they are also raising give uh, that morale that you can see that the, the winning is coming. Mm. Not uh, the both parliamentary, it's both presidential and then parliamentary. We are winning. What message are you giving the people when you go to campaign? Uh, campaign messages, I have three policies that I'm going around with it. Healthcare, education, and job creation. So these are three main uh, objectives that I have as my, my, my policies, yes. Healthcare, education, and job creation. Education, the MPP say it's free education they've done. When we went to the market, the women were talking about free education. What is your education policy? Uh, uh, free education, we started it as a progressive education. That is why our former president, uh, His Excellency John Damani Mahama, started to put up uh, day secondary school uh, buildings. You know, we were able to put up over 40 completed, and the rest we left it uh, be because uh, uh, we were not able to continue working government. So when we are back to government, we we'll make sure we we'll continue the rest and then. We we'll open our arms. When we went around, people said the former MP, Amase, had done a lot of good things. She was building part of the market. They said the roads, she has done a lot of work. So you are NDC coming. The MPP candidate seems to have done a lot. People are admitting that. So what's your comment on that? Uh, it's a good thing, I may say, if you expect uh, an MP who will not abandon the project of the of the uh, predecessor, then it means as I'm also coming, I'll make sure I will continue same. Uh, Baba Jama did some before he left, and then I must say continued. He also come, he have done part, and is going. Uh, I'm also coming to continue. What mining? A lot of people have said that there appears to be a problem with the mining company, and also they are saying the Galamse business has stopped. What is your policy for the Ghana Consolidated Diamonds and also the issue of Galamse? Are you saying you're going to revive Galamse? Let's understand your policy very well. It's part of the job creation. Anywhere that I go, 
since here is a mining uh, uh, town or we are into mining industry, about the 80 percent or 70 percent of the youth that's their interest. So, uh, I'll revamp the, the DCD Diamond Consolidated Diamonds Limited. I need to connect, make sure I bring investors on board so that we'll revamp the, the company, which will create more jobs. You're watching City News Ramon City TV. Still ahead, residents of Hirsu did their quote living in fear of losing their homes in an impending demolition exercise by the Free Zones Authority. Stay with us, we'll be right back. Looking for something new this November? Looking for star-studded suspense. It's what rich and titled people do when threatened. They conceal the ugly truths to protect themselves. Maybe you're in search of true love. Roses are red, violets are blue. I've got a crush on you, baby, would you be my queen? What about a bit of family drama? Need something to keep the kids entertained. We're ready to help with the case, Mira. We'll look for clues. Perhaps criminally good comedy is your thing. <laughs> Whatever you're in the mood for, look no further than DSTV. Their eight-year rule in Ghana brought nothing but hardship and international embarrassment. A particular significance will be the enhanced powers of the airport. I'm missing some pages here. What about you, Mr. President? Have you been offered a bribe before? Um, you mean as president? As John Mahama. As a human being? As a person. Any human being in the world would have encountered, you know, uh, corruption in a way, uh, one way or the other. What are you going to do about this astonishing rate of uh, inflation? You're hitting 15%. People are suffering in, a, in very tangible ways. We've seen scenes in Accra that we don't usually associate with Ghana at all. Um, you know, Ghana, poster boy of the African continent, economy was booming. You know, where did it all go wrong? And, you know, with all due respect to you, on your watch? Um, well, I, 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 I don't know how to put it. I don't know how to put it. This is incompetence, clueless, embarrassing Ghana, embarrassing you. Don't let us go back. Let's protect the progress we are making this December votes the NPP to continue with the leadership of sex. You're welcome back. Now, hundreds of Ashaiman residents and supporters of the two main political parties, as the National Democratic Congress and the New Patriotic Party, together with fans of dancehall artist Stoneboy, have participated in a peace walk organized by the musician ahead of the election. The walk, according to Stoneboy, is to preach peace and promote oneness ahead of the polls on December 7. Elvis Washington has more in this report. Bon 
Livingston, Etchin Setter Club, and known in showbiz as Tomboy, the renowned dancehall artist started his music career from a shy man. Besides the national applause and acknowledgement for his craft, he's seen as an influential figure in a shy man, where he is deeply admired and respected. Annually, he organizes the Ashaiman to the World Musical Concert as a way of giving back to the very society from where he emerged. This time round, the artist has replaced the musical concert with a peace walk in preparation towards the general election on December 7. The peace of Ghana is very important. You see that many artists, many, many artists are actually coming out openly to declare their support for one particular party. I think as much as we all have to be democratic, there is a high need for peace because peace stands above all political parties. I have realized that no particular A-list artist has taken the keen interest to want to invest and even push for peace because that is what we need. Without peace, both political parties, the humongous two cannot function. Amidst singing and dancing, the about three hour walk started at the Simon Presby Junction through some principal streets and ended at the Simon Sakasaka Park. The walk also brought together parliamentary candidates of the NPP and NDC on one platform as a sign to their followers not to engage political opponents as if they were enemies. The candidates address the crowd after the walk. It's going to be number one because Nana, 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 Ashama, we are one people, irrespective of our political ideologies, irrespective of our political ideals, we are one people. Now, hundreds of residents at Shreso Didiako, a community in the Ejiso municipality of the Ashanti region, are living in fear of being rendered homeless after lands they acquired to put up their buildings were earmarked for a project by the Free Zones Authority. Now, the residents say while they are not against the Free Zone Authority's intention, they are only appealing to the government to ensure that their lands are not affected by the project. City News is happy to January report. More than 500 houses on this stretch of land have been completed with other properties here at various stages of completion. According to landlords and other property owners at Hueso de Diacon, they have confirmed that some lands in the area have been allocated for development by the Free Zones Authority. The landlords and property owners fear they might lose their assets and are seeking government's intervention. Yes, we believe in the development of the Free Zones Authority. We believe in what the government of the, of the country is doing on these lands for the state. Nonetheless, we are just pleading on, their be on our behalf that they consider us and take us from the allocation that has been done. Pending that, we hope that they will listen to us. We hope that they will hear us. We hope that they will feel our pain. First and foremost, because we know they are still at the development level and we know that they will likely and very most likely listen to us. First and foremost, we do not have any ulterior motive at the end, but we know that they can take it out of the portion but if they do not then it means they just want to render us homeless the residents are worried they will be rendered homeless should the government fail to intervene we are pleading we are on our knees begging them to at least at least help us take off uh, our area from the, uh, the the free zone that is our plea we are, we are not here to blame anybody. Yeah. We are not here to, 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 to push blame to anybody. Yeah. What we are here to do is to plead, mm. to plead the authorities, yeah. to please come to our aid, help us yeah. take off our area so that we can, we can have a place to lay our hands with, our heads with uh, our families. Well, that's it for today's edition of the City Newsroom. Log on to our website. We have more stories there. Subscribe to CityTube on YouTube for more exclusive video contents from City TV. Download the City Newsroom app from the Google Play Store and keep updated on the go. 
You can also watch City TV on DSTV channel 363 and Go TV channel 182. My name is Vivian Kai Loko. Mine is Omaru Sandamara. Do have a pleasant week.